Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to do a fake unboxing of the Falcon Eyes F7 RGB LED light. What's a fake unboxing you might ask? So that's very easy. You have two YouTube channels, one in German and one in English, and you unbox the product in German, then realize what do I do with the English channel, then you go to Final Cut Pro and try to record a voiceover over the original German footage, realize it does not work, and then you decide to do an unboxing again, but without the original plastic cover of the product and hope that your English viewers are not mad because you promised them the next unboxing will be on the English channel first. So let's unbox this again. Okay, here we go. So the Falcon Eyes F7 comes in this white box. It's called Pocket Light and it comes with a diffuser and with a grid. So that's a combi package and what I found quite funny is that they provide a quite detailed address on the back of the box. So Pocket Light is the trademark for Falcon Eyes Pocket Light series. The manufacturer of this stuff is Jinke Photographic Equipment Factory. Equipment with a typo. In, um, yeah, so factory eyes. The address is third building Dongsheng Industrial Zone beside the second Dongsheng Road in Guangdong Village, in Fenggang Town, in Dongguang City, in Guangdong Province, China. So if you ever want to visit them um, and you want to program your Google Maps, just use this address or you can also call them or send them a fax or visit them on the homepage. So as the plastic uh, cover is already gone, as I told you, j let's, uh, let's just open it and on top you will find the LED light. Normally, when you do this um, the first time, there will also be a protective film um, on the top. And we'll lay, lay this to the side and dig in. And on top there is um, a sticker which um, yeah, depicts all the different um, special effects scenes. Um, then you have a manual with um, yeah, what the box contains and um, many Chinese um, signs. The um, pocket light comes with um, yeah, quite nice um, bag and in the bag there is an, a USB type A to USB type C cable also with um, nice um, cable holders and it's um, also um, long enough, so that's quite good. Then you have um, a magic arm to mount this um, on a cage, for example, or um, to a light stand, whatever you want to do. It also has threads on this side. Then you also get um, um, yeah, a flash mount, so um, called a hot shoe mount, to mount it directly onto the camera. Then that's all and you get this diffuser and also a grid. Okay. So the grid you can just slide it, you can slide it on and then um, the light becomes much more focused and you will not have as much uh, spill light as, um, as without the grid. And also the diffuser. And this takes some getting used to so you don't have to insert it completely. It just sits on top of the light like this. And by this you can diffuse the light and um, have it much softer. Very good. So on top there is a um, thread for mounting it on a light stand or um, mounting it to this magic arm. Um, then you have the USB type C um, port and then there is nothing. And on the other side you have um, controls three. The first this knob is for turning the unit on and also for setting um, the different mode modes. Then you have um, 
a um, yeah, lever to um, change in the menu. And then you have also this um, small thing to um, Okay, on this side you have the controls, you have this knob which turns the unit on and also you can use it to set different modes um, on the light. Then you have this rocking lever um, which is used to change um, the parameters or, um, and you have this dial which is used to control the brightness. Long press turns the light on and then you are in CCT mode. CCT mode is just um, yeah, using the white LEDs and you can change the brightness of the light and you can also change with these F rocking lever the um, temperature of the light and it goes from 2500 so very warm light to 9000 which is a very cold light. The next operating mode um, is when you press the um, the button uh, the, the the button one time, and then you go into RGB mode. You have this RGB wheel which shows you which colors are which degrees. At the moment, it's set to 150 degrees, which is kind of a um, cyan light. But you can also just press this one time and then change it by holding down or um, pushing up and then you can um, yeah, access all the different RGB colors and when you press F again then you can also change the saturation of the light as you can see it becomes desaturated so you can tweak it um, really and you can also can um, change the brightness. When you push the set button again, you um, enter the special effects. In total, there are 20. And um, yeah, let's just switch the different modes. So at the moment, they are off. First mode is police car. Second mode is ambulance. Third is fire truck then you have two lightning modes this one and the second one you have an HSI demo where the unit cycles through the different colors um, in a slow manner and in a fast manner Then you have a TV screen demo mode, a candle mode, paparazzi, strobe light for inducing epileptic shocks, high and low beam bulb, so it is when a car is passing by and uses um, the high beam bulb. Then you have this double flash, so warning light of a car, red flash, green flash, blue flash. You have two party modes, party one and party two, and you can decide what you like more. You have breathing white, which um, resembles a heartbeat. And you have, and beware, close your eyes, RGB strobe. Um, yes. And off. So these are the three operating modes, CCT, RGB and the scenes. And um, what I forgot to tell you is that the whole thing is also magnetic, so you can mount it to a magnetic light stand, for example, or to a fridge or to something other magnetic. Um. 
Also, the build quality is quite nice. It um, has an aluminum frame. Um, it's really heavy for the size, so really quite um, dense. And I really like um, overall build quality and um, yeah, for this price, really great okay, product. Okay, so that was the fake unboxing of the Falcon Eyes F7 RGB LED light. If you have any questions to this light, just post them in the comments. I will come back to you for sure. And until I see you in the next video, I will have some fun with the special effect modes now. See you in the next video. Bye bye.